Mm -hmm. um, so I come from from Kibra, so my MCA is um, in Ranokoth. Yes. Yeah. Income. Not income. Current MCA. Outgoing MCA. I have no idea. Yeah. Honorable Sony. My area MCA is called. Okay, I don't know the name, but it's food in Akazi. That's what we know him with. <laughs> I don't know his name. Uh, what you do? Obote. He goes by Obote. Keep calling someone. <laughs> My area in peace is called Honorable Honorable James. Wait, Honorable yeah. Yes, I Yes, I get. No. 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 I don't. Sina called Sina Steven. I don't know his full name, but he's usually called Wamashu. Who's your MP? Yes, I will. Yeah. Yes, I'm going to vote. Yes, I will. Time to vote. First time. Um, what are some of the issues? Uh, Hopefully, why? Oh, I must vote. Yes. Okay, just leave the hopefully part, but I'll have to vote. Yeah, I have to exercise, exercise my democratic rights. I think I will. I'm not sure, but I hope I will. Why are you sure? Because I've not yet known who the leaders are, the ones who are buying. So once I know them, and I vet them according to how they taught. In the session, that's when I know. Yeah. I'm leaders. Um, right now, the protection of corporates, that's one. Because um, in the past few months, um, year, in the past year, there have been um, campus students who are killed and their bodies, um, their parents or family members aren't, any, um, aren't told of how they were killed. They're just told, come pick uh, your bodies and they go. Um, another thing is about the food crisis. Um, recently, they have really gone up. They are still going up, actually, and that's crazy. Another thing is um, providing spaces for the youths. Employment, mostly. Yeah, some of the, I think they should focus on creating more employment and giving funding to those who have startups and are into business or just want to venture into business, entrepreneurs, Okay. Okay. First, I think, okay, with the previous incidents and the prices of food going high, I think they need to explain the reason to why like all this is happening because you just can't add cost to to the to the food prices and like expect us like to just go smooth with it. I think they need to give a valid expl explanation and a reason to it as citizens so that you can understand and if there is a possibility of the prices going lower or they will go high or they just remain constant. So okay. I think that's the main problem we're having at the moment as a citizen because we can see our parents and the medium and the low cl class people are going through. Um, I'd, like to, I'd like to answer that question for channeling the leaders from my area. I'd like them to um, address the issues of insecurity and food shortage and uh, yeah, especially those. As a voter, mm -hmm. I want like my leaders to address the following, like internships in my county especially. Mm -hmm. I come from a county whereby like the university students haven't been given a space to be the like interns in a mm -hmm. the county government. So I'm looking forward so much onto internships. Mm -hmm. I'm looking forward to a selective like you you work for it to get a scholarship. Not like because there's this like Finland scholarship. But I've seen my leaders telling their own children, I'm looking forward to I'm going to vote for people who are going to give us scholarships. <laughs>
as a model, as a citizen from that point. Yeah. I think we need to address youth unemployment mm -hmm. at this time because we have so many graduates at this time with great degrees and they don't even have jobs. Uh, the market, uh, the employment sector is filled, it's flooded, and they need to look for ways to check it.